We flew to four different game camps in Kenya, and we saw a lot of game uh, everywhere, but in every camp we saw giraffes. We would do a game drive each morning from about 6.30 to 11 o'clock in the morning, and then we'd do another game drive uh, about 4.30 in the afternoon to about 7 p.m. And every day, you just never knew where the road was going to take you. One morning we were following a black rhinoceros and we were driving off road and we followed this rhinoceros for about a mile. Uh, nearby was a giraffe and as we're driving away from the rhinoceros, Diane spotted uh, something underneath the acacia tree. And so we drove around to the acacia tree and here was this little baby giraffe all curled up. And we parked the jeep very close uh, and were there a while until finally the uh, little giraffe woke up and spotted us and poked his head up and realized what we were and he jumped up and ran off. A group of moving giraffes awesome. is called a journey of giraffes. The animals seem to accept the presence of the jeeps pretty well, but if you wanted to uh, walk outside the camps, you uh, had to walk very carefully and always with an armed guard. Here's where our naturalists uh, gave me permission to try and stalk up on the uh, giraffes, but the giraffes weren't having any of it. As I got closer, they very gently moved away. A group of standing giraffes is called a tower of giraffes. As our two weeks in Kenya drew to a close, we returned to Nairobi where we got to stay at a very special place called the, the Giraffe Manor. The Giraffe Manor was built in the 1930s as a recreation of a Scottish hunting lodge. But in the 1960s, um, the family that bought the uh, place uh, decided to rescue the Rothschild Giraffe, which was in danger of becoming extinct. So now the Draft Manor has 10 guest rooms and you can stay at the Draft Manor and you get to meet the uh, Rothschild giraffes um, that they rescued and you get to do some interaction with these animals who are still wild giraffes. At about 5 o'clock in the afternoon a few of the giraffes will come up to the terrace near the lodge and uh, provide you got some pellets and are feeding the giraffes They'll come up and uh, visit with you, and um, as long as you keep feeding them, they'll be real friendly with you.
And then at 6.30 in the morning, the drafts come up to the manor, um, and we had this front bedroom, so the drafts came up uh, to our bedroom window, and uh, we could feed them right out, of our, right out of our room. Then from about 6.30 in the morning to maybe 8 a.m., the drafts visit the uh, breakfast room. And while you're sitting there eating your nicely prepared breakfast, the drafts will stick their head in the window and um, interact with you. Uh, they really like the pellets you feed them. This is Stacy having uh, breakfast with Diane. So just how cool is this?